Well, it's a beautiful, balmy 24 degrees here in Michigan. So it's as good a time as any to freeze my toes off in the garage and make a jig that I've been wanting to make for quite a long time. I hate turning my saw blade to anything other than 90 degrees once I get it dialed in. I do have a digital angle finder that I can stick to the blade. I still don't like doing it. So I decided I'm going to make a jig that the plan is that it'll fit clamp over my rip fence. So I can move it in and out if I just want to take a little bit off of a piece of wood or slide it in to take the full 45 off of uh, take a full 45 off of a uh, end piece of wood don't have any plans drawn up just have an idea in my head we'll see how it goes see if it works might not if it doesn't welcome to post five productions Tell you what, this might just be a cheap DIY rip fence. But oh boy, oh boy. When I set it to 12, it cuts at 12.
want to sneak up on this line on that seam. just what I wanted so that way it's barely touching this if at all on front and back well, let's let's run this through and see how she does I don't have to crank my blade over take it off 90 when I know I have it dead thanks for joining we'll see you next time take care